Hunter activists Heads loaded with theory The hearts of food and passion Share the same left-wing politics Like the same music They were part of the protest movement well, Anna presented herself as a feminist Stole the way they talked and dressed Fashion is stuff and anarchist Eric fell in love with Anna After meeting at a content conference He didn't know it But Anna was an FBI informant Eric fell in love With an FBI informant Shared his dreams of revolution I was sitting in solitary confinement Be careful what you think be careful what you say, my views against you in court one day. Well, Anna thinks she's a hawk, she's just a fucking snitch. The headline caught the believers Comparisons are made to a terrorist organization Well, Anna had the car, Anna pay the rent Anna had found the recipe to make the explosive She encouraged her friends to fall through with their plans They were gonna build a bomb and blow up the Nimbus Dam Her conversations are being recorded They didn't know it, but Anna was an FBI informant Sitting in solitary confinements Be careful what you think Be careful what you say Might be used against you in court one day Well, Anna thinks she's a hawk She's just a fucking snitch Black suburbans and AR-15 rifles Agents made the arrest in a Kmart parking lot Caught with the supplies to the bombing hands The they were charged with conspiracy against the government Ran in Jensen, traded testimony in exchange of leniency Eric was sentenced to 20 years in the penitentiary Eric ran in Jensen, racked the best They didn't know it, but Anna was an FBI informant Confinements. Be careful what you think. Be careful what you say. Might be used against you in court one day. Well, Anna thinks she's a hawk. She's just a fucking snitch. See, Anna thinks she's a hawk. She's just a fucking snitch. I wrote the song in as a stool pigeon about the activist Eric McDavid, who's currently serving 20 years on a trumped up conspiracy charge to blow up the Nimbus Dam here in Sacramento, California. If you're interested in learning more about Eric's case, go to www.supporteric.org.